Good day everybody, this is Dark Comet and welcome to my channel. Hope you're having a great day so far. Welcome back to The Last of Us Remastered. This is going to be episode number 13 of this incredible tale. Hope you're enjoying the story so far. It's getting quite exciting if you ask me. In last episode we saw Joel and Ellie arrive in Jackson, Wyoming. And there they found a hydroelectric dam power plant where they encountered, to their surprise, Joel's brother Tommy and his wife Maria. They were trying to get power back on at the dam so that the families living in Jackson could have electricity. And while they were doing that, unfortunately, a group of bandits invaded the dam and the group had to fight and kill them off. And then Joel and Tommy had a heart, the hard talk about Ellie's condition and the fact they're trying to find the fireflies. And eventually Tommy was persuaded to take Ellie with him as they go search for the fireflies out west. Unfortunately, Ellie overheard some of this and she thought Joel might leave her and she got very upset. So she stole a horse and ran off. And then Joel and Tommy had to pursue after her on horseback. As they were doing that, they were ambushed by a group of bandits killed them and then they found Ellie at an abandoned ranch house where they also had to fight off another group of bandits. A lot of bandits in these woods here. <laughs> and then they were told by Tommy that the fireflies might be at the University of Eastern Colorado at a big science building there that they can't miss because of the slant of the building and the mirrored surface. And then Joel tells Tommy to go back home to his wife because he's now going to take Ellie. He's made up his mind and it can't be changed. So that's kind of where we left off last episode. In this episode, we are going to be arriving at the university in Colorado. We're going to search the university for the fireflies. We're going to find some interesting things there. We're going to battle multiple groups of infected that were out throughout the campus there. We're going to search for more clues on the fireflies, and eventually we're going to make our way to the science building. And there we're going to find out some things about the fireflies that gave a clue of where they are and why they haven't been around the campus. So let's go ahead and get busy on this tale there. I'm not going to give away too much of the story. It's quite exciting, quite challenging, and I think you'll enjoy it. Right, it's called turnover. And if you clear the 10 yards, then you're back at first down? First down, that's right. Man, it's confusing. <laughs> you just gotta play it a couple of times. It all makes sense. So after the cutscene there and with the discussion on football, make sure you turn your horse around, head on up to the top of the hill here. There's gonna be a Savage Starlight comic book for Ellie up on the hood of one of the cars up here. You can easily miss that one if you just continue into the university, so just make sure you turn around here, pick it up, and then head back down, and that's all there is up here. Stay, Callis. What kind of name is Callis, anyways? Not my fault you forgot to ask Tommy his name. Callis. I bet Elliot like this. Get your back. I'll stay with Callus. I hate that name. Well, let's go. <laughs> Come. On. Okay. None of these buildings look like a mirror to me. Well, we'll head to Central Grounds. Should be able to see most of the campus from there.
Get him. I'll be right back. I'll be here. Looks like a good spot. So, big places. People would live here and just study, even though they were all grown up. Yeah, study, party, and find themselves. Figure out what they wanted to do with their lives. What they wanted to do with their lives. There was a lookout here. That's a good sign. There's a sniper's nest log here in the corner of this balcony. Make sure you pick it up. It's part of the collectible artifacts that you need for the trophy. I'm not going to read it word for word. I'll just scroll through very slowly so in case you want to read it, up to you, it's up to you. But this sniper here is complaining about how boring it is. He's complaining about management. He's sending his friend back and forth wishes regarding the holidays, about Halloween and Christmas. So I'll let you guys read through it, and we'll get on to the next one.
Go back. Gooch. How many people do you think are there? Fireflies, I mean. You reckon it takes quite a crew to run that operation. You think there'll be other people my age? Uh, I'm not sure. thing. Juice. See if I can get the power back on. Oh, my God. 
That a fact. Yeah. Can you imagine being up there all by yourself? Would have been cool. I'm just saying. Serious. Sing something. Uh, no. Come on, I won't laugh. I don't think so. Joel, please. Go back. Aw, are those monkeys? Yeah, a whole mess of them. Kind of awesome. First time seeing a monkey? First time seeing a monkey.
Over here on this cabinet is a, another training manual. It's for health kit upgrades. It makes your healing 67% stronger. It's all about sterilization. It's in the field medicine and emergency care procedures field manual. To sterilize your wounds, you need to make sure that the effectiveness is the best it can be by making sure that everything is sterilized, including using boiling water, washing your hands, making sure your tools and your bandages are sterile, and then making sure that you dress it properly so that it can heal better in the long run. Come back. Hey, look, fireflies. See it. This is good. First sign of fireflies. Watch yourself. You too. There it is. In this drawer here is a student's journal. It has a lot of good information in it. I won't read everything word for word, but I'll give you the general gist of it. So nine months in waiting and still nothing. No word from anybody. Found some additional cans of food in the dining commons, but they won't last. Had an incident at the Eastern Hall barricades, but everything is still secure. Caught a glimpse of a group of those things running around. I saw one that looked like Heather. Maybe it was Heather. Since the batteries are running short, they're only listening to their radio once a night. 
Cheryl was smoking out yesterday, said she needed it. She got pissed off when I threw out her stash. She doesn't get it. We need to keep her head clear. Someone's going to have to go to town and get more supplies. It's probably going to be me. Wonder how long you held out.
After you kill all the clickers, you have, still have to take down this bloater if you want to get your trophy for getting all the firefly pendants because the bloater is actually one of the fireflies that turned. So you have to take him down. Let's go ahead and test out our new flamethrower and see how it works. Pretty awesome. After you kill the bloater, you can then reach down and pick up the firefly pendant. In this room you're going to find a newspaper article here, which is quite interesting. It's about U.S. military recall search effort. With the latest WHO report estimating that it, as much as 60% of the world's population is either dead or infected by the CPI pandemic, the United States military has released a statement that they are recalling all their search efforts. Regions of up to 10 miles from each quarantine zone perimeter will remain under patrol for citizens attempting to enter, but no further effort will be made to evacuate those potentially trapped in hard-to-reach areas. Attorney General Arthur Monroe made this very clear in a letter. More infected, I'm fine. Here, come up on the gate. Try the gate. Ha! You did it! Yeah. Come on through. Scoot. Those clickers. You go. You think they were fireflies? No. No, I don't think so. Why would they have an effect so close to the lab? 
Well, Bill used them as a form of defense. Maybe they're doing the same. Yeah, I could see that. No guards. No nothing. Yeah, I'd expect to see someone by now. Let's get inside. Have you ever been to one of these? What, university? Yeah. <laughs> no, not as a student, at least. Why not? Uh... I had Sarah when I was pretty young. Hmm. Were you married? For a while. What happened? Okay. Too much? Too much. better. Go back. Hey, what about over there? Yeah, that looks like a way in. Rusted shut. I'll have to find another way. Maybe we can get over it.
All right, not what I had in mind, but it'll do. All right, we're inside. Come on, kiddo, give me your hand. There you go. Thanks. Let's look around. Care for mankind over here. Anyone? Let's keep it down until we figure out what's going on. the end of this hallway here you're going to see a locked door on my right up here and that is going to require a ship to open it but it's well worth it make sure you go in here there's a lot of materials in here there's a there toolbox which upgrades you to the next level and there's also a field training menu for your molotov cocktails which makes your radius of your explosion two times wider which could be really good especially if you have large groups of things you're fighting it's in the insurgent ordnance fabrication and tactical deployment field manual Improved radius of incendiary bombs, proper use of incendiary devices important to ensure effective detonation. And over here on the table right here, you'll see the next tool level upgrade to level 4, so make sure you don't miss that. See what we got.
there we go. Nothing useful. Ain't nothing here but a bunch of medical mumbo jumbo. I don't get it. Looks like they all just packed up and left in a hurry. Maybe not all of them. Stay close. Good, right? We found out where they went.
clickers. Yeah. No fireflies either. Well, maybe in all that research, they turn into fucking monkeys. Just keep searching. We'll find something. We didn't mess with them monkeys. He didn't say where they went. I know. Let's just keep looking. Yeah, no shit. Do you know where that is? I know the city. Is it far? It ain't close. I mean, on horseback. What? Fireflies? Get down! <laughs> oh! That'll do it for today's episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm really enjoying playing this game again. It is so much fun. I know I haven't played it for such a long time, but every time I play it, it just brings me joy, and I hope it shows up in the video that I'm showing you guys. Make sure you hit that like button. It really helps out my channel a lot, and hit that subscribe if you haven't done so already. For those who are new subscribers, welcome to the channel, and for those who are already current subscribers and watching the game, thank you so much for joining me on this epic journey of The Last of Us Remastered. Please leave me a comment and let me know how things are going, if you're enjoying the series, and if you'd like to see anything else from me in the future. Check out the description down below. I have done quite a few things so far. Uh, Red Dead Redemption 2, uh, Ghost of Tsushima, The Last of Us Part 2, uh, which you can also find. And of course I just did a bunch of videos on Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and we'll see you on the next Dark Comet Adventures, guys. Take care.